Ahoy, Mickeys! Today I'll be spinning a tale you won't soon forget. It's called SpongeBob SquarePants versus the Patty Gadget. Now SpongeBob was working his eye on the grill till he heard a sharp sound that gave him a chill. What's going on? What can it mean? Wow! It's a deep fry patty cooking machine. And hiding behind it, who do we see? None other than Squidward and his bad face acne. Hey! What is this contraption you've hauled into me place? A miracle, a marvel. It will cook Krabby Patties at a fabulous pace. But how are the patties? I mean, how do they taste? I'll let you try one. Shove this in your face. I have to admit, that patty was yummy. Though it sits like a rock when it lands in me tummy. But I've got me a fry cook, and he's always on time. Ah, but this gizmo is faster, and you won't pay it a dime. Your machine sounds delightful, but how much does it cost? Hmm, just fire SpongeBob and tell him get lost. The machine wanted his job to make SpongeBob quit, and SpongeBob didn't like it. No, not one bit. Pushing his grill, SpongeBob burst through the door. I challenge your gadget. I declare Patty War. With three little words, Crab started the show. Flag raised in the air, he cried. Ready, set, go! Quick as a flash, Squidward pulled the big lever. Then sat back and watched, feeling oh so quite clever. SpongeBob with spatula held tight in his fist, flung 20 patties. Not a single one missed. The crowd was impressed. What? They cheered full of glee, all except Patrick, who had to go pee. A noise and a clatter came from the machine, and out popped the patties in a burst of hot steam. The gadget was fast, its first batch completed, but SpongeBob yelled out, I won't be defeated! He took in some air. Oh! SpongeBob swelled his physique, then dozens of patties filled up his cheeks. He strained and he sweated. He summoned his will and shot Krabby Patties right onto the grill. Not bad, yelled out Squidward. A really good try, but let's see how you do against my machine set on high. The gizmo, it shuddered, it clattered, it shook, and his Squidward laughed. Uh -huh. Sandy said, What a schnook! But old SpongeBob cried out, I won't lose to that thing! Then he raised up two spatulas and left like a spring. His hands were a blur. The patties went flying. He fried up a hundred without even trying. Squidward was worried. SpongeBob couldn't be beat. I got one last chance. I'll turn up the heat. He struggled and strained till his face turned dark blue. Then the lever moved forward and broke right in two. The gadget buckled and sparked. It cracked like a gun. So Squidward took off, yelling, Let me know if I've won! Lightning flew from its maw. It looked ready to burst. But SpongeBob, still standing, yelled, Foul beast! Do your worst! The patties came flying by twos and by threes, by dozens, by hundreds, oh, it was something to see. By that machine, it was fast, but SpongeBob was faster. He'd proved to that thing that he was its master. The gadget blew into bits and died with a boom. The blast was so loud, it woke King Neptune. Over. It was all over. Finished and done. With his head held up high, SpongeBob knew he had won. The crowd yelled, Hooray! Squidward's name is now Mud! But as they were cheering, SpongeBob fell with a thud. <gasps> the service was short, tears shed with regret. Squidward, it seemed, was the one most upset. <laughs> What's that? You thought SpongeBob was buried down there? They just buried the gadget. Ha <laughs> ha, this I swear. Well, that ends me tale straight from the book. Now I gotta go and polish me hook. <laughs>